Um, I'm Levi Stout from Invercargill, PDGA number 118179 and these are just a few of the discs that I like to throw and these have been in my bag. Um, started off with a fairway driver, TL3. This is very straight for me, it just goes, it's really good for low tunnel shots and in the wood shots and it's very good for up to about 90 metres for me. Um, next up, got a Kiwi. This is a really nice turnover disc. I can throw it on hyzer and it'll still get over. Or I can roll this and it'll get over to the right really quickly. I also like to throw this for stand-up forehands that sort of get a bit of flip and then turn over a bit. It's just a really nice turnover disc and I can utilize it quite well. Next I have the Star Wraith. This disc goes far. I can throw it flat and it'll get a bit of turn and fade and it will be slightly overstable but I use this a lot for just low hyzer shots um, if I put a bit of anhyzer on it I can get up to about 110 meters on it it's just a really nice disc and I also like to throw it forehands next up a prototype Kotari from RPM discs this thing is an absolute meat hook I use it for extreme utility shots, shots that need to skip really high and forehand flex shots that I can start on extreme angles and it'll still flex out because it's just so overstable. Um, and my max distance driver, the Star Strike. This thing just gets up gliding, it just turns over, comes back, goes reasonably straight but I know I can pump this up to about 120 meters consistently and it'll, if I hyzer flip it, it'll have, also have that integrity but still get plenty of distance on it. Um, moving on to mid ranges. Um, first of all, Mako's, two of them. I find that this Champion one is a bit flippier, so I throw it on a bit more hyzer. And I use it for mid range turnover shots. That I could be using this one, but this has just got a bit more stability to it. It's very straight tunnel shots that only need to go up to about 80 meters but very useful in the woods and I just like throwing them far. Uh, next up the Z Buzz from Discraft. This thing is it can handle plenty of torque but it will still travel a long way and I use this for shots that I just need a bit more left finish than the Mako might use it every now and then for forehand shots just that I need to finish quite straight and it's probably my furthest flying mid-range at the moment um, next we have the Kia this is a nice utility disc it's quite slow for a mid-range but quite fast for a putter so it's sort of in the middle um, I use this a lot for forehand up shots backhand hyzer shots it's re reliably overstable no matter how I throw it. I know it's going to come back left or right depending on how I throw it. And it's just an all round nice utility disc to have in the bag. Um, putters. I throw, oh, putt with uh, Magma Ruru. I love throwing Rurus as well as putting with them. This is just nice and grippy. It catches chains on either side. And I just like this medium plastic for anything within 30 meters, jump putts, just any sort of putting that I need to do. I'll use my Magma Kia, ah, Ruru, sorry. Um, next I have another Ruru. This is my throwing Ruru. It's absolutely dead straight. Uh, it doesn't have any variation right or left. It just holds the line that I put it on. And if I get a bit of hyzer on it I can trust that it will finish left and it will have a bit of integrity. It's probably my favourite throwing putter in the bag right now. It's always super reliable and I can always trust it. Um, the Tui. I carry two at the moment. This one is very stable. It's quite straight but I can still get a bit of turn so I can throw this I can throw this with as much power as I want on hyzer and it'll just flip up and just glide dead straight. 
and it's really good for throwing quite high but still getting the same distance and I use it for just slight turnovers in the woods and yeah it's just an all-round great disc and then I have my more flippy toy that I use for more extreme turnovers with putters and I sometimes use it for the occasional forehand that I just need to get left quickly and it will just hold that line and glide out and this has been in my bag for about a year year and a half now it's super reliable nice and understable and I know its stability quite well and lastly Star Aviar X3 it's overstable doesn't go as far as my Kia which is quite good because I can use it for shots that only go about 60 meters when I throw it full force it's got two glide and it really shows when you throw it it just doesn't go anywhere it's a meat hook you know that it's not going to skip it's just going to hit the ground and stay there and it's a really useful disc for shorter range spike hyzers and utility shots just like that.